Hello everyone, uh, I'm Anne from Added Makes. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for stopping by. And today I have a Dollarama haul to share with you. Um, actually, in the last two days, I've been to two Dollaramas and two Dollar Trees. So I'm gonna have uh, several videos because it'll be way too long to put this all in one video. So let's get started. Uh, yesterday at the Dollarama that I went to, I finally found the DCWV uh, papers that are 11 by 17 inches. It's the premium stack, double-sided brights, and it has templates at the back as well. It's just really bright and beautiful colors. And being this size 11 by 17, yes, I can cut this on my Cricut or I can cut by hand. Here are the templates at the back. And these templates are for helping you make uh, this box here, this like strawberry box and the flower. So I got those and these are, 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 <laughs> I think they were four dollars. Like the price is not on here, but I'm assuming they were four dollars and there were two left on the shelf. So I got two. And the worst thing is, this is coming from the girl who just said recently, I don't need more paper because I got a whole whack of paper uh, from Cricut just the other day. And that's a video that I did film, but I haven't uploaded it yet. So you have to be on the If you want to see all the stuff I got from Cricut, all the supplies, um, that's in another video that I have to upload. So let me know if you really want to see that. If you're not interested, then I won't put it. Uh, I won't put it up. I saw these beautiful flower bulbs. The, well, the bulbs are not beautiful, but they will make beautiful flowers if the squirrels do not get to them before they have time to bloom. I try to plant these every year, and since we've been living here, I've had no success because I have wildlife digging up the bulbs each year. And But I'm trying again. This is... That one dahlia, dahlia is a really, really big flower and it's gorgeous. And the bulb is 250, so I got this one, which will be this range of pinks with some yellow. And then I thought this beautiful deep purple one uh, was gorgeous. And the third one I got is this nice bright pink. They had so many different colors. But I limited myself to these three because if they do take off, uh, they do, you know, have babies and, and the garden gets bigger. I found a lovely pot. I've been looking for a pot to transplant some plant. I have a plant that's just outgrown its pot. And it had like babies and I, I want to, you know, move it to another pot. Um, and I just, I wasn't liking any of the flower pots I saw. And I saw this one finally yesterday and I really liked it. And I thought this will go well in my home. And this was $4. It's very heavy ceramic. So I got that. Now the other thing I picked up were these, um, oh yeah these little spice jars I have um, made or rigged up I guess I actually made an organizer that spins to hold jars of buttons and stuff and the the, the spaces on this uh, organizer are about the size of these spice bottles but all the bottles I have now are acrylic and I wanted more acrylic, but I haven't had any luck finding acrylic in this size. I found acrylic of much larger sizes or very small size, but this is the size I needed. So, and I needed about three more of these bottles. So I got these ones and these are $1.50 and I will be um, using these to store little embellishments like buttons and things like that. And I sh if you want to see my my contraption that I made, my organizer for my embellishments, uh, I could show that to you in another video. I have been 
putting baskets around uh, the top shelves in my studio and the shelving I have is just not deep enough for other baskets I had so I'm hoping that these ones will fit and I like that they're white so I have already two big white bins on the extremity of that shelf and I'm hoping these will go in the center so I got four of these and these baskets are three dollars a piece so, got those I picked up this uh, basket skirt wrap it's like a little pink tutu apparently you put this around a basket for Easter for decorating for Easter but that's not what I thought I would do with this although this was two dollars uh, I thought I, I might try to make a tutu for my cat that would be really funny but um, yeah I'll see if that works and if not I can reuse the material for something else and I just got this one because it's pink and it's pretty I also saw these jute bags for Easter you get three in here either this kind of jute type of bag and they come in pretty colors really pretty pastel colors they had blue yellow uh, green and of course uh, pink I think they also had li lilac like light light purple uh, but I got these pink ones um, I won't be using these at Easter but I just thought that these would be really cute to do some sort of embroidery on top of or cross stitch piece of the fabric so yeah I got two packages like this and like I just said two dollars for the three I got a box of cake mix so I can make a cake for uh, this weekend and this one is the rainbow bit super moist by Betty Crocker and I got the can of whipped vanilla icing and you know what I don't even know how much these are I think they were about two dollars a piece I don't remember there's no price on them but I just needed them so I grabbed them and then this item oh, there's no price on it so this was either this was probably three or four dollars I saw this stuffs sliders make up to three stuffed sliders at one time so it's just when you make sliders those mini burgers and it's like a contraption to uh, help you stuff the meat so you put the ground beef or ground meat and you stuff the center with something so you have stuffed sliders like stuffed mini burgers I just thought, okay this is a gadget I know but uh, I just I thought we would try it. Oh, see, it shows here. You put the ground beef inside, and you, you know, and the, this part helps you shape that into like a cup, and then you can stuff it, and um, then you can seal it with, I guess, another piece of ground meat. So, and that, yeah. So I got that, and I, like I said, it was either three or four dollars. I will look at the receipt and I'll have the price on the screen. They had some more of these foot long, extra long, I call them foot long, but I don't know if they're foot long. The extra long uh, Twizzlers. And these are so much fun and they're so yummy. Uh, so I got these and these packages are $4. They're very, they're very, very long, very good. Something that was new to um, me and my store are these cable ties by Duramax. They are 11 inches long, but they're made of stainless steel. So I thought these were really different. I'm used to uh, finding the, you know, the white plastic zip ties, but the stainless steel ones I thought could be quite handy uh, around the garage, the workshop, and the garden. Uh, they might actually be something useful in a DIY. So I got these and the package includes 10 of these uh, stainless steel zip ties and it was $2. Here's the other item I picked up. They 
they had not had these in a long time so I was very pleased to see these and these are the rice cakes with milk chocolate I think these are really really yummy and I like snacking on these uh, they have no salt so that's good for me but they do have some chocolate but um, they're so, somewhat healthy <laughs> and these are there are six in here and these are $1.25 I also got this down in the craft aisle. They have these really skinny, skinny wooden dowels. They're just like, they're like little, I would say like skewers, but really th thinner than skewers. Thicker than a toothpick, but thinner than a skewer. And they ha they don't have pointy ends. So these I thought would have a purpose in some sort of crafting or DIY. There are a hundred of these sticks in here, and this is $1.25. So for those of you who like to do lots of crafts, fairy gardens, these might be useful. I, oh, I'm so glad to see my favorite hair bands. They had more in stock, so I picked up a few packages. There are four of these squiggly hair bands and these are the like fabric ones uh, they're not the rubbery ones I prefer these in my hair and these are sassy design and they're a dollar 25 for a package of four so I think this is a really good deal so I got a few of these packages just because I I really like using these in my hair and I tend to lose them so so I thought this was a great, great find at Dollarama. They, this is new. Um, these are double-ended markers. They are a pack of six. And they're a pack of six and they have basically a fine point and a chisel point. Yeah, they say broad or large and fine, um, but the, these are the points. So it's really a chisel and a fine. Now, what I don't know if is if these are water-based or alcohol-based. It doesn't say. So you get six of these big markers for uh, $3.50. They are the Kraft brand, so that's a Dollarama made for Dollarama product and let's try it here uh, it writes on the plastic quite well and let's see yeah oh okay so I just tested this on the inside of a Dollarama bag and see it it wrote on the plastic and it stayed it's not coming off so this would be a, a permanent marker so it's a double-ended permanent marker i guess this is kind of like competing with those other alcohol based uh craft markers in the that are in the uh, craft industry so you get this package pretty good you get these six for 350. These were new to me. They're little butterfly stickers uh, made of lace and like a little pearl. They had two different designs at my store, so I got one of each. They're very, very pretty. And they are $1.25 for a package of four. I've seen a lot of people haul these and I wasn't interested in getting that, but uh, then I did yesterday because I, I got an idea for how I could use this and I was calculating how many letters there are and if I could spell something and what I intend to use this little cinema light box for is to put the letters sh filming <laughs> uh, because I can't tell you how many times I will be filming video and um, members of my family just don't get it. They just are other people that are here uh, working for me or just they just don't get it. They see me in the studio, the doors are closed and they just don't get that I'm actually filming a video and I can't be interrupted at that time. 
<laughs> so I'm hoping that if I have this and I put it like, you know, in, in the doorway or outside my studio, uh, that people will get a clue <laughs> that sh I'm actually filming. <laughs> Uh, anyway, so those little light boxes are four dollars. I picked up a bottle of the Bismuth uh, for whenever somebody needs it. It's like this is not something that we use often in our family. It just it's once in a blue moon, once a year maybe. But I just thought uh, we didn't have any, and I, when I saw this, I thought, yeah, this is a good thing to have on hand in our pharmacy. So get this little bottle of Bismuth for $2. There's 118 milliliter. Yes, it tastes awful. It's very chalky, but when you're, you're really sick to your stomach, you know, it's better than nothing. Other thing I picked up were these... Uh, adhesive mirror sheets so it's all little pieces of mirror kind of like to make a disco ball I think there's even a picture of a disco ball here and I just thought oh there might be something I can do with this uh, some sort of crafty project so I'm trying not to put the glare in your face and these little sheets uh, this is the size of them and they are a dollar 50 yeah these are a dollar 50 each and they measure 14 and a half centimeters by 14 and a half centimeters so uh, that is that so that's that for uh, my dollarama haul from yesterday I have another one to share with you but I'll put that in another video hey I'm back I forgot to show you these. Uh, I saw them right after I turned off the camera. I was like, oh, how could I forget that? But uh, I did, and uh, so now I'm showing them to you. They have these new rhinestone stickers. Well, they're new to me, and I just thought they were so beautiful. You get two of them. Well, there's actually like uh, five pieces on this one. They have these beautiful parrots. Uh, they are a dollar fifty. A dollar fifty for these uh, gem stickers. And they also had these cute little pink birds. It was all bird type of gem stickers, so uh, rhinestone stickers, let's call them. We've got the little birdies, and this blue birdie. Be cute. And oh, the toucan. I think the toucan is my favorite. They're just so cute. So that's that. And uh, I hope you liked this video. If you did, I would so appreciate a thumbs up. Please like, comment, share. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And just in case you're wondering, yeah, I, I'm in the process of working. I have several deadlines. I've been just crafting and making, going to bed late, uh, trying to meet deadlines, and, and it's just crazy. And uh, one of the things I've been working on is uh, these little paper flowers. And that's all I can tell you. <laughs> <laughs> so uh yeah and uh, take care of yourself thank you for stopping by and i'll see you after the next video bye